This is cute and I like the little high neck on it. Okay, dress. I don't know where I'm going or where exactly I'd wear you to, but you cute. It's you running through my veins. Your love runs through my veins. What's up, YouTube family? So, you know, I've been on like this whole weight loss journey for a while and I have actually lost a lot of weight. I started, it's been, I wanna say about a year and maybe three months that I've been on a diet from doing strict keto to like not so strict keto. And then you guys know I did that uh, vegan challenge for a week. So, with all that happening, I started, my starting weight was 225 pounds, and I am now down to 182 pounds. So a lot of my clothes don't fit me as well as they used to. Like, everything that was cute on me before is swimming on me now. So I hit up Shein, bought myself some new pieces, just a few little items, and so I'm gonna share them with you guys now. And I'm gonna, just a disclaimer off the bat. The problem with buying clothes after you've lost a significant amount of weight and you're still in the process of losing weight is that you don't technically know what your size is. So a lot of these clothes that I bought, I thought, like this was just me, I thought that I was a 14. I started out as an 18 dress size. I thought I was made it down to a 14, but I am not a 14. I'm actually a 12. I have never been a 12 for as long as I can remember, but that is my new size. I am a 12. So I've only tried on one of the outfits so far. We, we Y'all gonna see. We're just gonna see how this turns out because I bought everything in a size 14 and that is not my size. So we're just gonna get started with the accessories, okay? All right, so first things first was this bracelet set that I bought. Get it closer so you guys can see. It's like, I'm gonna have to open it because it doesn't really do it justice. Um, it was only a dollar. And it was like after I had added all the clothes to my cart, I was like, mm, let me see what the accessories section of Shein is talking about. And this bracelet set was actually only a dollar. Which in my personal opinion, makes it 10 times better. Here we go. What did I drop? All right, so it comes actually with like these little dainty bracelets. It's all tangled, but here we go. And of course you can like make them, size them to fit your wrist, but like it's really cute. So you get these little tiny dainty bracelets. And then this one just has like a bunch of little honeycombs on it. Do one of these so you guys can actually see. So it comes with these two and then it also comes with these bracelets. So you actually got four bracelets for a dollar, which I love. See how this fits on my teeny tiny wrist. Alright, so that's cute. So yeah. My one dollar bracelets. Might as well just leave that on. And then came this little book bag purse, which I just thought was adorable.
like is this not just the cutest thing you have ever seen and it has like the little rose on the top I think this is so cute so it has like the little front pocket for like your lip gloss and such all the little quick little things you need to grab let's see does it have like an extra long strap or is this yeah so on the inside comes the strap oh and like a little matching scarf or is this supposed to be a strap as well not quite sure but this is cute I don't know if it's supposed to be like a headband you could make it a headband I think I would probably make it a headband but this is cute and then here's the extra long strap for the book bag so yeah this is so stinking adorable so then the strap clips to like these little pieces here on the sides but I think this is so cute like with a cute little pair of jeans like a real casual kind of outfit like I this is cute and then the last like accessory piece I bought was this book bag slash tote combo and to be honest I really don't know why I bought this like when I opened up the box and this was on top I was confused because I really don't remember adding this to cart but I guess I did because it's here oh oh it has like a lot of pieces so I guess it has like your little pencil holder for the book or no this is your pencil holder so this is just like a little whatever this is supposed to be um <laughs> I can't think of what it's called right now so let me just put this in the pocket but yeah it's just a regular old book bag and it says on the front life is an ice cream can you guys see that yeah life is an ice cream I'm even more confused as to why I bought this because I don't even know what that means what does life is an ice cream even mean I don't know what I was thinking when I purchased this it must have been like really 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 cheap and that's why I got it it's the only thing I can think of that justifies why I would spend money on this book bag um, <laughs> but then it comes with the little tote same confusing message that life is an ice cream uh, life is an ice cream in the comment section below please explain to me what that means what are they trying to say because I'm confused if you couldn't tell I'm very confused but I mean grocery shopping this will work put it in the car in the trunk that way I always have like a little carry bag for when I go to the market <sighs> but okay that is everything that I got accessory wise now let's get into these clothes the first piece that I got is just this green tea and it says just a good mom with a hood playlist and honestly this describes me to a T like this is this is me I am this shirt it describes me perfectly pull up to my kids school in the drop-off line with some Drake blast and like good morning <laughs> how are you but yeah just a plain tea um if it's nice again this is a 1x I guess it could like I do have some extra space on the sides so I could have gone down to an extra large or a large but whatever I like the extra room so that is the first shirt and these pants are not 
from Shein. I didn't pick these up. These are a Walmart special that I've had for a while. So here is the first shirt. Okay, so here is the next top. Uh, a black crop top with the saying on it, my body, not yours. And I remember when I put this sh shirt in the cart, I was like uh, in the mindset of, yeah, this is my body. Like, I'm going to just be proud of it. Y'all going to accept it, whatever shape or form it's in or whatever. Because I think I had like hit a plateau for the month or the week where I like didn't really lose any weight and I was like eating horribly and I think I like gained a couple pounds so I was just over it and fed up and I was just like whatever but now that it's here <laughs> I still like the shirt but that was my mindset when I got it because I normally don't have shirts that like show skin like this right here like I'm trying to come to terms with it and pull it down as far as it'll go but it's whatever it's still cute. I like it. Okay, so now it has started. Like, this shirt is way too big. Like, it's not how I wanted it to fit at all. This, I definitely could have gone down a size or two. Like, I like the saying on it. Like, the crown and the queen bee. Like... I like it. It's just too big. It, it doesn't fit how I want it to fit. So I think I've never returned anything before that I've purchased from Shein. Like, never. But I think this will be my first. Because it just doesn't. Yeah. This does not fit how I wanted it to fit. At all. It's cute. But just, it's, it, it's a no. All right, so now we're getting into the dresses portion of this little mini haul. And this one, I actually really like. And again, I got everything in a 1X. So this kind of worked out because it's not like super tight. Like, you know how... I feel like if I would have gone and gotten my actual size in the 12, like it would have been really, really tight down here at the legs and I would have to walk like this because there would have been no space for me to move. So this works for me. This is cute and I like the little high neck on it. Okay, dress. I don't know where I'm going. Or where exactly I'd wear you to, but you cute. You look real cute. Alright, let's try on the other ones. So, this is the second little dress I got. And I have on the wrong underwear with this. So, hopefully, this dress isn't see-through because it kind of looks like it is in the you find her but this is like super super thin like super thin and it just says it's your loss babe again it had to be super cheap and that was why I added it to the cart because like it's okay but it's not like better than okay So this is this dress like when I say this material is so thin um, but honestly this would be like for a really hot day with just a pair of sneakers like some real cute low tops and maybe like a nice little jean jacket on my shoulders just to go be cute for a second like this that's just this dress is just something quick to step out and be cute in like honestly with my hair just like this makeup not too heavy like something real quick and cute 
that is what this dress gives me. So yeah, this is this dress. Now let's move on to the next. Okay, so this is another pair of pants that I bought. I actually only purchased two pairs of pants. So this is the first pair. Um, they're like those, I don't know, what do they call them? Like trash bag, like the balloon type pants. On Shein's website, I remember that it said that they were sweatpants, but this is not sweatpants material. Like there isn't even a tag on the inside to like tell you what material exactly this is, but it's like, I don't know, it's thick, but it's not, I don't know fabrics like that, so I don't know what to call it, but it's not sweatpants. Like, but it does have like the scrunchy bottom on the legs, like joggers, but again, not sweatpants. Like, I honestly don't know what I would wear these with. Like, shoe-wise, at least. Because the material is kind of like dressy material. But then the scrunched bottoms. Like, I don't know if they expect you to like, wear heels or something with this. Not sure. Have to experiment. But it, like, comes to a V at the top. So if I didn't pull these up, like it would just fit like at a V underneath my belly button, but you can pull it up. Um, but I mean, they're cute, they're comfy. And then this shirt was my favorite thing in the cart. And it says, thou shall not try me. Mood 24 seven. And this is the God honest truth. I was the most excited about this shirt of majority of the things that were in my cart. Um, this is not a crop top. I just kind of tucked it because honestly, that's how I wish it was and most likely how I'm going to wear it. But it actually comes all the way down here. So if I ever just want to wear it with a pair of jeans and it fits exactly the right way that I wanted it to. But this is cute. I mean, I wouldn't make this an outfit because like it, the pants come with this drawstring on them too, like a tie. So this is definitely, the pants are definitely for something dressier and the shirt is just casual. So this is not a fit, but it's cute. So yeah, on to the next. Okay, so this is the last pair of pants and I believe my last top, the other pieces are like nightwear. So this is the last outfit. And these two I actually did buy to go together and to be an outfit. This is like a really one of those stretchy bando like jean. Um, shirt and then it comes with this little tie and so you slip the tie through the center and then you tie it in a bow in the front so it like scrunches up in the middle um this is really cute it just it does fit me a little big like i have a lot of space and room in the back which i guess isn't too bad it's not like suffocating me because it's so tight but it's cute and then I got these high-waisted jeans to go with them and they're like really stretchy um and I really like the outfit like I really do I'm kind of getting like a uh, Selena vibes like you know how she would wear in her pictures like she would have a top like this with like a pair of high-waisted pants like this kind of what's giving me I really like it though the only thing is I wish I would have got these pants a size smaller because yes they fit it's just I just have this bit of extra room right here 
that I don't love. And then like in the pockets in the back, it kind of like has some extra space, like extra material. But they're cute. They're just a tad too big, which sucks. But even though the pants don't fit exactly how I want them to, I still really like this outfit. Like this is a going out with your girls on the town type of outfit, like date night with the husband kind of outfit. Oh, this is real cute. It, clubs are open anymore, but this is what I would wear that to. Like just going out with friends, have some fun, look real cute. But again, first I would have to find some friends because we just got out here. But if I had some friends and clubs were open, this is what I would wear. This right here, all of this. This is what I would wear. Okay, so the last two things, two things in my hand, but really it's three because I bought this same one in pink, but I wore that one last night. So these are the last ones. And I said they were nightwear. And they're like just some like lingerie type things. And they're cute. Do not get me wrong. This one is very cute. However, it is too big for me. Like I was really swimming in it. And then I tried to use the straps to like tighten it up. But with me tightening up the straps, it like lifted the whole romper like further and further up. So it, by the end of it to where it like got to be where the girls had some support, it turned the whole thing into like a thong. And that's not the most comfortable thing in the world. Especially since I was just trying to be cute while I go to sleep. Like, that's it. That was all I was trying to do. And this took me to a whole, it sent a whole different message to my husband. I was tired. I just wanted to go to bed. We're not going to talk about it. But this is the romper. And again, I also bought it in pink. Like, it's cute. It's just... It was sending the wrong message, but it's cute. And then this second one, uh, it crisscrosses in the back, so I'm trying to get that together. But let me just hold it from the sides. Okay, this second one, it is really cute. It almost looks like it's like a skirt, but it's not. I'm just gonna hold this up to my body because I know some YouTubers like try their lingerie on and like show it to y'all, but I'm not about that life. So <laughs> some things are just meant to be private and this thing is showing all my private. So I'm just gonna hold it up like this. So originally I thought it was a skirt. Like I thought this part here was just like a little dress type situation. It is not. Um, it's real cute though. What it actually is are pants, but the whole middle is split. So like everything from like here down, it is just split. Like you just, it's, it's just an extra, it's an opening. I wasn't truly aware of that when I added it. Not that it takes away from it. It's still very cute. It's just, this is like anniversary, like wedding anniversary. Y'all don't got no kids at home. You get a hotel, y'all just out and about on your lonesome. That's what this is for because this part right here, <laughs> Like, especially in the back, 
Like in the back, everything is open. Like the split goes all the way up. All the way up. So everything from here down is just, quite frankly, exposed. It's all exposed. But it's cute. It is cute. You just, you have to be just the two of y'all alone. Like, because this shows everything. Like, every single thing. But it's very cute. I like the color. I like that the top is like lace. I even like the bottom. It just, I couldn't show it to y'all. So y'all just gonna have to take my word for it that it is very cute. <laughs> Cause you will never see me in it. Like never ever, ever will you see me wear this. But it is very cute. My husband will see it, but y'all won't. So that is everything guys that was everything that i got from shein on my little post weight loss clothing haul it wasn't really a haul it was more like a just a restock of some stuff just to see where i was size wise but okay please make sure you like comment share subscribe and let me know which piece you guys like the most or what things have you bought from Shein or any other online store that you guys have liked because hey my birthday is coming up and I'm down to go shopping again to get some stuff for my birthday I don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing but I always use more clothes <laughs> especially now okay but I'll see you guys at the next one bye